All right, guys, so let's go ahead and check out the room. Now, we've been here for eight days already. When we came in, we were ex extremely tired. It was like four or five o'clock in the morning. I want to show you what the room looks like. It just got cleaned. So with that said, let's get started. We're staying at room 2002, and this is a four single bedroom. So when you walk in, you get plenty open space. You got one bathroom. Wish it was at least a half a bath, but you got one bathroom right here with one sink. I'm wearing my Arabic clothing, Ibaya, a really nice shower. You have a shower head and a shower handle, so it's been really nice taking a shower here. And it's got a bench you can sit on as well, of course. And then toilet to do your business. Once again, a lot of space. Uh, storage, plenty storage. You got plenty stuff here already, as you can see. We've been using it quite a bit. And here is the beds. So you have one, two, three, four. So you got four beds. And of course we got Cito's baby crib there. You have one TV. So I wish that once again, there's one more TV for the kids. We've been watching a lot of stuff on it. So it's a nice size. And right next to it, you have a area where you can work, you know, working station. Uh, the beds are really nice, really comfortable. You notice a lot of lights here and, and a lot of seating area. So we literally have one, two, three seating area, four or five. So a lot of seating area. And of course, the most important thing, the best views of the room is this right here. You got amazing view of the mosque. As you can see, there are people, there's a line of people walking. They're getting ready for the fourth prayer of the day. As you can see, people are already lined up. You got people on top. You get some nice views for sure. And this is the city center here. And they still got plenty of construction, as you can see. One of the cool things with this room is when the prayer is called or when the prayer happens at the uh, mosque masjid, and actually and they have a speaker in your room. So you can literally pray with them. Your prayer counts as part of the haram, which is really, really nice. And then for us to walk, we literally just walk down the blue line right here. And literally it's a three, maybe four minute walk and you're at the mosque. It's a very, very short walk. Another thing that I like as well, there's a second window. This is where the kids areas. So another set of windows, I've already opened it up. Uh, another thing that I really like as well, you can actu actually open these up and hear the mosque from here. So the prayer just came on. There's the speaker box right there. And I'm opening the window so you can hear it as well. It's coming directly from the mosque. By far, favorite part of the room is being able to be here, praying at night, anytime you want. Just seeing the traffic go in and out of the uh, mosque is just an amazing feeling. I know it's not a cheap hotel. Uh, we got lucky, we got it really cheap. Actually, we got it for uh, 250 bucks a night. I was looking at the uh, rates right now, it's 400 bucks a night. So the prices have really, really jumped up. But if you can help it, if you're gonna spend a couple hundred bucks, you know, I would suggest spending a little more and getting a room like this where you have a view uh, of the uh, haram. In my opinion, it's well worth it. So there's not a feeling to explain it.